Hey, this is Toby and in today's video I want to talk about why you need to test your own strategies. Because if you trade a strategy and you have not tested it yourself, you are in big trouble. Okay, let's go. Okay, so I want to start this video with a statement because I've been trading for a few years now and I have never met a profitable trader who does not develop and backtest his own trading strategies. Never. So every successful trader I know develops and backtests his own trading strategies. So maybe that's a reason why you should also start to develop and backtest your own trading strategies. Okay, so after explaining what backtesting is, I want to talk about why you have much better chances if you develop and test yourself instead of using trading strategies from other traders. Okay, so backtesting is just applying a trading strategy to historical data and you just want to check if the strategy is profitable or not. And this gives you the opportunity to test a strategy without risking real money. And if the backtesting shows good results, then you can just apply the strategy to the live market. And I will give you a quick example for that on the whiteboard. Okay, so a quick example how to do a simple backtest. Let's say we have our historical data for the last 10 years, for example. And now we just check for sell and buy conditions according to our strategy, of course. Let's say we have a buy trade here and here and a sell trade here and here. So we just want to check if our strategy was profitable in the past. And of course, we can do this process manually by just scrolling through the chart and we save each trade into an Excel sheet, for example. But of course we are automated traders, so we can do this process much faster and more accurate. So we just code our trading strategy into an EA, Expert Advisor for MetaTrader 5, for example. And then we use the strategy tester to get a result in a few minutes. And how to code your Expert Advisor, your first Expert Advisor, it's really not that difficult. I have already made a video about this. I will link it up here. Okay, so that's basically how you do a simple backtest. And of course you hope that the result of the backtest will carry on into the live market into the future. Okay, that's it. Okay, so now I will tell you what is so dangerous about trading a strategy from someone else. And I get a lot of questions about trading strategies. What strategy do I use? Can you give me a strategy? And most of the time these questions are asked by trading beginners because they just want a finished trading strategy. And I can understand this desire for a trading strategy because I was in the same position a few years ago. But this is not the right way because you need to develop and test your own trading strategies to become successful. And I will tell you why. So if you develop your own trading strategy, you know exactly how the strategy works, in which situation you make money and how large and how frequent are losing trades, for example, and also how long does a drawdown last and so on. So you just get a feel for the strategy. And I know this sounds a little bit strange because I'm an automated trader, but you probably have tested different variations of the strategy. So you just know what to expect if you trade a strategy in a live market. And now if you deploy a strategy and the strategy starts to lose money, has several losing trades in a row, for example, if you develop this strategy on your own, you can be pretty relaxed in this situation because you know whether this behavior is normal or not. If you trade a strategy from someone else, you will stop the strategy at this point. And if you say no, I don't believe you because you just don't have the confidence in the strategy. I've seen this behavior so many times. I can give a profitable strategy to a trader and the trader will lose money with it. And it's not because of the strategy, it's not because the market has changed. It's just because the trader does not know the strategy and does not have confidence in the strategy. And this is also called strategy hopping. If you switch the strategy as soon as it starts to lose money. I will also make a video about this in the future. But there's another reason why you should definitely backtest your own trading strategies. And by the way, if you like the video so far, well, just leave a like. So what happens if you trade a strategy from someone else, you just get a strategy and this strategy actually no longer works. What do you do? There's nothing you can do. So it's like if you want to become a pilot, for example, but 
you don't learn to operate the plane yourself. Instead, you just fly always with a headset and someone is telling you over the radio each step what to do. Push this button, do this, do that. That's not only crazy, that's scary. What happens if, for example, you lose the radio connection? Well, have a nice flight. I just hope I'm not one of the passengers. But if you know how to backtest and develop strategies for yourself, you will just create a new strategy and you will keep on trading. And if you want to know how to develop your own trading strategies with MetaTrader 5, I have created a playlist and I will link it up here. So this is how you start. Okay, so now you know why I think it's essential for you that you develop your own trading strategies. And if you have a question about automated trading or you disagree on this topic, just write a comment. And now you can watch this video here where I show you some of my strategies. These are live strategies, live trades. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.